So in this quick video, I want to show you how to download and use FileZilla to copy this picture of a battery or any other picture or file from your computer to the World Wide Web so that anybody can access the picture over the internet from anywhere in the world. If you have an eBay or Amazon business or you, you sell products from your own website, what I'm going to show you now is a popular way of copying product images from your computer to your own domain or website using FileZilla. And if you don't already have your own domain or website, I'll also tell you where you can get one. Okay, first thing you need to do is download FileZilla. I'll put a link on the screen and below the video where you can download FileZilla now for free. Once you've downloaded FileZilla, double click the file that's downloaded and FileZilla will open up as you know, per the screenshot. Next step is you need to fill out the three boxes with information about your host, um, username and password. You normally don't need to populate the fourth field, which is the port field. Now for these three pieces of information, you need to contact the company who is hosting your domain name. Now just in case you don't have a domain name, you, know, you might be scratching your head, you know, what, what a domain name is. A domain name is a website name, i.e. You know, www.xyz.com or you know, www.xyz.com.au or you know, any other website address, .ifos, .ws's and a whole stack of others. Well, to get really back to basics, www is short for World Wide Web. And the other part before the .com or the .com.au or .ifn or whatever, or any other extension, is the domain name that you've purchased, i.e. XYZ. Then after you purchase a domain name, you know, i.e. www.xyz.com, you need to get it hosted, which makes it live on the internet. Then you can use a program like FileZilla to copy files from your computer to your domain name. If you don't already have a domain name, I'll put a link on the screen and below the video you know, where you can basically where you can get one. Okay, back on track. Once you've opened FileZilla and you've entered in the three pieces of information, that's you know, your host, username and password, FileZilla will then basically split your screen in half. The left side shows you all the files on your computer, the right side shows you all the files on your domain. To copy a file from your computer to your domain, you simply just drag and drop it. In this example, I'm going to drag and drop a file in my downloads folder called battery.jpg, or as known in the industry, JPEG. And then drop that into my image folder, which is on my domain, neilwaterhouse.com. As this is just a small JPEG file, it only takes a second or two to copy. To prove this has worked, if I go to my browser and type in www.neilwaterhouse.com forward slash images forward slash battery dot jpeg, bingo, up comes a picture of the battery. That's all for this week. Please scroll down and leave me a comment below. Until next week, list more, sell more. This is Neil Waterhouse.